my bad, my bad, my bad. Hey, you sorry, cup. Hey everybody, Jason Rothman here for RothmanPPC.com, and I am back with the 18th of the 100 moving company marketing tips. And today's tip for you movers out there is to really think about your leads separately. So the tip today is do not clump all your sources of moving leads into one category of moving leads because all moving leads are not created equally. And I love that for the video title. So that's what the title will be. The tip is all moving company leads are not created equally. Let me tell you why. So today I was talking with one of my clients. He runs a great moving company out in the great state of Maryland, out there on the Eastern Seaboard. And he is new to AdWords, meaning he's only been running AdWords for the past few months, but he's been in the moving industry and business for uh, a long time. And what he was telling me today is that, hey, I really want to drill down on my AdWords account and my campaigns right now in the slow season, in the, in the winter, get everything fine tailored up and, and ready to go. Uh, and then in the summer, when the volume is really there and we're in the season, uh, he's just he told me he's just going to invest everything he can in AdWords. Here's the key. The reason why he loves AdWords so much is because, quote, I've noticed the difference with the quality of the AdWords leads. Quote, I've been able to charge them higher prices. So this is one thing I always stress to my clients. The cost per lead from an AdWords campaign is going to be more than the cost per lead at one of your everyday uh, moving lead providers. Here's the reason why. The lead providers send your lead to you and then whatever, three other movers, four other movers, five other movers, whatever program they have set up. And how they get those moving leads, I don't even know. So who knows? So who knows the quality and, and where they're coming from? Um, but with AdWords, here's the thing, with Google AdWords, we're able to tell from the use of search terms what someone actually typed in Google when they saw your ad, went to your website, and called you or filled out the lead form. So we know what people typed in Google with their search whenever they become a conversion for you, whenever they fill out a lead form or call your business after clicking on an, an AdWords ad. So number one, we know the quality is high for these this AdWords traffic. We know exactly what they search for. So if you're a moving company in Maryland or Baltimore and we're able to see someone actually type in Google, moving companies Baltimore, Maryland or Baltimore movers. So they're actually looking for a Baltimore moving company. Beyond that, and here's another key, with an AdWords lead, you get to be one-on-one -on -one with the customer. You get to feel out that customer. Um, is it someone who is a shopper? They're shopping around prices and they're going to go with the lowest price, excuse me, no matter what? Or is it someone basically you can charge higher prices because they're looking for quality and if you go over all your features, all your benefits, all your experience, all the uh, things that make your moving company different than the other moving companies and this uh, customer who really wants the, the top, top notch of the market for his moving company, you can sell yourself as that company because you are and you can go over all those features and benefits and then you can charge that person higher prices than you charge the, the price shopper. And the reason you can do this and have this flexibility with your pricing and charge people more is because you get to get one-on-one -on -one with the customer. You get either their lead information and you contact them or they call you directly from an AdWords ad or once they go to your website from an AdWords click and you're one-on-one -on -one with the customer. So you're no longer one of five moving companies that invades their email inbox as soon as they ask for a moving quote from those lead providers and then they're just looking at your email address and your price and that's it and you don't get to separate yourself from the pack. With AdWords ads, you get to get on the phone with them one-on-one -on -one and sell yourself and sell your company and also feel out who that customer is uh, and what services and, and price levels they're looking for. And if they're looking for the top end of the market, you can offer that and you can charge them more than you would 
just sending a blind email to, to a, a moving lead that five other people are going to send a blind email to. So today's tip is that all moving leads are not created equally. And if you understand that, you can see the value of something like advertising on Yelp, possibly, or advertising on Google AdWords, definitely. Um, and you can also feel out the different leads and understand that, okay, for this set of leads, um, I'm going to bid lower because this is a more competitive lead market where I don't get to be one-on-one -on -one with the customer. And then maybe for the AdWords traffic, I am one-on-one -on -one with the customer so I can feel out people who are looking for the highest end movers and charge more to those leads. So look at your leads separately. D determine uh, the, the quality and the type of leads in terms of the type of customer you get from the different sources of leads. And just look at every source of leads differently. And if you you view every source of leads differently and you actually let it affect your uh, pricing and where you put your marketing budget, um, you'll be much better off than if you just blindly look at moving leads as moving leads no matter what source they came from. So that is today's tip. We have a bonus tip for you and that is to click the like button and your life will get way more lucky. So thank you for watching, thank you for sharing and we will be back in the future with the other moving company marketing tips. Thanks so much.